This is a moped, not the guy, the bike. All over the world, mopeds, motorized bicycles, are a viable form of transportation. In Europe alone, there are over 13 million of them. But here in the United States, with our preoccupation with speed and size, mopeds have not caught on. That is, until now. In 1976, moped sales have quadrupled to 100,000. All over the country, people are looking at the benefits of the machine. It gets over 100 miles per gallon while hitting speeds of 30 miles per hour. Its sticker price is between $300 and $500, and in Texas, you don't have to have a license or insurance. All you have to do is take a written test. So all you really need is the money, and perhaps a little personality. How about the image, though? You get the leather jacket and everything. Some people miss them. <laughs> well, I'll tell you frankly, that was funny to me because uh, my hands were very cold the other day, and I stopped in a shop, and they showed me gloves, and they were red <laughs> with cutouts of white stars and blue. <laughs> and I thought, my gosh, with the, the helmet and the jacket, I must look like I don't know what. Peter but, Fonda. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the reason they call them mopeds is because it's a motorbike with pedals. Ah, the logic of it all. You just get on, start pedaling, and zoom away into the sunset. Bill O'Reilly, Channel 8 News on a moped in North Dallas.